Op de boot uh, een case gecracked en nu gaan we case 9 spelen. Despite the Goldwyn's Day Bank holiday, Inspector Hastings is in a flap. It's his wife's birthday. Oh mijn god, gaan we nu iemand helpen met iemands birthday? Dat lijkt me toch niet de bedoeling. Oké. Okay. Well, now I've finished my book, I think it's time for a nice cup of tea. Oh, but I just had some tea not long ago, didn't I? In that case, perhaps a siesta. Oh no, Cheryl, I'm afraid I couldn't possibly. Not today. Miss Layton has a very good reason for not tidying up. What? Because it's Godwin's Day. Godwin's Day? Yeah, it's one of the annual bank holidays we enjoy in London. Oh yes, it's a very good reason, of course. Godwin's Day has a very ancient history behind it, you know? Many, many, many years ago, um, right here at the capital, St. Godwin appeared to the king of the land. Uh, your majesty, your projects are exhausted because... Uh, your subjects are uh, because because they are working too hard. Do you not see them suffering? The king looked around at the land and saw that the saint was right. Hmm. Feeling ashamed that he'd failed to notice his subjects suffering, the king made a day a, uh, the day a holiday from the, that year forward and named it for the saint. Obviously, nobody knows if that's really what happened. But anyway, today is a bank holiday, so no one is allowed to work. That's right. As a Londoner, I, uh, it would have been a terrible fox faux pas uh, to do any work uh, at all today. These transactions are very important, you know. Mm, you're such a modern forward thinking woman. Godverdamme, wat een lik rage is dat. Oké. Laat me maar de inspector uh, even komen met uh, dat ze vrouw jaren dus. Kijk. We hebben een visitor. Oh, you're here, cat. Thank goodness I find you. I was ready to throw in the towel if your office was shut as well. Oh dear inspector, you seem very fluster, uh, flustered. In that, it's that. Uh, is it a case? Something grisly, perhaps? Grizzly doesn't come close. In all my years being a detective, I've never come across a situation that's stickier than this one. Golly, whatever happened, Inspector? It sounds like we need to brace ourselves. All right, Professor, fill us in. Yes, well, it's um, delicate, you see. I don't uh, like to think about it, to be honest. The thing is, it's the, uh, my, it's the better half's birthday today. Sorry. What does that have to do with the case, Inspector? It only appears once a year, see? And, um, well, to put it bluntly, I forgot. I haven't got her a present or a cake or anything. Um, it wouldn't be uh, I wouldn't be surprised if she gave me the... Leave... Ik weet niet wat er staat. Unless I can do something to fix this. So I need you, cat. Um, I need those little gray cells of yours to get me out of this mess. The Battle of Hastings. Okay, what the neuk. I was anticipating a case the likes of which I've never seen before and you give me a marriage rescue operation? Uh, would it be your shell? Talk about being used as a dog's body, Woyo. Quite right, miss. Nobody likes to be used as a dog's body, do they? How did this happen, Inspector? How did you manage to forget such an important day? I've uh, got to no one to blame but myself. It's just been uh, so busy these past months, I totally, it totally slipped my mind. I marked it on the calendar and everything, precisely so I wouldn't end up in this situation. And where's your calendar? In my study at home, and I've got one in the office at the yard as well. Ah, I see. Well, it's no—I want no wonder I did. Uh, you didn't notice then. Oh, why do you think that, Miss? 
elementary, my dear Ernest. The inspector just told us he's been extremely busy, which means he not uh, have no time for sitting in his study at home and probably precious little time in his office as well. He's been out and about. Ah, of course, he hasn't uh, even had the time to look at his calendar to notice the reminder. Exactly, I haven't get, uh, been getting back home until the small hours recently. Uh, which is another reason I was thinking I better make an effort this year for a birthday. Well, it's not too late, is it? The day isn't over yet. Mm, that's what I thought, sunshine. So I've been all over the city looking for something for her. But it's Godwin's day, isn't it? Every shop um, I look at is closed. I can't buy a pre her a present and I can't get her a cake, cake. Even the bakers and the like are shut today. Uh, I can't uh, get a table at any restaurant either. In fact, this place is about the only establishment I've come across that's open. Well, we're not technically open uh, today actually. <laughs> I've got until this evening uh, to come up with something. Okay. No, it doesn't. Uh, I, I've been out all day looking for a present, you see. And now, here I am. No better off. Okay. Oh, Inspector Hastings, here you are. What is it, Constable? Um, let me see. Oh, yes. Uh, it says there's been a break-in at the city center. The perpetrator uh, is on the run, apparently. Really? Yes, and he left uh, a note. Um, where is it? Oh, yeah, here it is. Catch me if you can. You stop it, stupid pigs. That's a challenge, is it? Right, Booker. I'm on my way. You go on ahead to the scene. Yes, sir. A break in? Oh dear! Working on Godless Day? Uh, what was the thief thinking? Sorry, cat. Uh, I'll have to go down there. Of course, Inspector. You can't ignore blatant goad goading like that. Uh, too right. Uh, but we haven't worked out anything for uh, the missus yet, have we? Uh, leave that little problem to us and go to catch that thief. Uh, you can't leave the people of London in the lurch. Okay. Uh, that's not just not you, is it, Inspector? That's fine. Okay, he left in rather a hurry, didn't he? Yes, and we have to hurry now too. We must come up with something for Inspector Hastings' wife before the end of the day. I'm not sure what we can do to advert disaster uh, there, miss, are you? We just have to think of a present so wonderful it makes her forget all about the fact that um, he let it slip his mind. Okay. Oh, you must be the detective, I presume. Oh, yes, that's right. Can I help you? Uh, we've spoken before, I think. It's Catriel, isn't it? And this must be Ernest with you and Shirley or something, is it? Mm, who are you? Oh, I'm Felicity. Felicity Hastings. Felicity Hastings? You mean you're Inspector Hastings' wife? Yes, that's right. He's always telling me how much you've been helping him. Oh, well, yes. We've worked on a number of cases for him now. Oh, yes. Well, sorry. I mean, my husband has nothing but good things uh, to say about you. I assure you. He thinks you're a very talented detective, you know? Oh well, I don't know if to say London's best, but... Apparently you have an, a unique personality and a knack of solving difficult cases. A, a unique personality? Oh yes, I hear you're uh, a genius when it comes to puzzles. Uh, that's a good one uh, that I know. Why don't you give it a try? Ooh, I'm Fuselboom, legger legger. Legger 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 legger. Birthday Brain Teaser Today is the preschooler's birthday. Um, there were some number shamed candles for the cake to show her age, but they've been dropped on the floor and now they're in pieces. If you arrange three of them together, uh, they would make the right number. Slide the pieces uh, of the candle into the box on the right to make the number. Okay, then we dan weer even lopen. Ik ga laten zien aan jullie. Uh, is it dead? I've 
see how to solve this now. Oh, ik had, uh, That's not like me. Ik, ik dacht van nee, dat, dit nummer kan ik maken. Dat is het dan goed. Maar ik had denk ik uh, meer naar het kindje moeten kijken. Relatief klein kindje. Oh, dat kan ook nog. Dit zou meer sens maken. I've seen how to solve this now. Ja. Any mystery or any puzzle solved. Heel jong kindje. Well, I can see why my husband calls you um, on your services so frequently. If only the problems were so easily solved. Oh dear, do you have something on your mind, Mrs. Hastings? As a matter of fact, I do. I'm rather down the dumps today. London can be a very gloomy place when you're not feeling your best. I'm sorry to hear that you're not happy, Felicity. Uh, I hope that changes for you soon. Aren't you sweet, Catriel? I don't suppose I couldn't bend your ear, couldn't I? Of course you could. I'd be glad to hear your troubles. It's just that my husband's job is so demanding, you see. I know it's a wonderful thing that he does, and I do support him. But just once in a while, I would be, it would be nice if he thought about me a little. Uh, you know, it's my birthday today, and because it's a bank holiday, I'd hoped he'd be able to spend some time together and celebrate for once. Yes, of course, birthdays are very important, I think. Of course, I was fuming when I found out he had forgotten. Uh, when he uh, got all romantic and said, I'll get you a present if it's the last thing I do, and ran off. Well, a present would be nice, but the truth is... Thirsty. Sorry, listen to me. I've done, done nothing but gumble and gruse. I thought he could pop out the hairdresser and maybe get ice cream on uh, the way home uh, to cheer myself up. But everywhere is shut. Oh, it's shut, of course. Oh, that is it. Ship. Uh, I suppose I just have to try and forget all about to go home with my tail between my legs. Well, I don't want to take any more of your time. Thanks for listening. That poor woman is very upset, isn't she? Yes, Inspector Hazen said she was uh, angry, but she didn't seem angry to me. Not so much as Bloodhound. Okay. Hmm, we must find a good present. If not for uh, Inspector Hazen, it's for Felicity herself. Hier, hier. I wonder what it would be good. Uh, ik denk dat zij wil dat hij uh, haar ter, ten huwelijk gaat vragen. Volgens mij, dat, 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 dat gevoel heb ik in ieder geval aan de woorden die ze gebruikt. Oh. Oeps. I suppose an outfit for some kind of and some kind of jewelry would be the obvious choice. Uh, the sort of thing we might find at the boutique down the road. Why don't we have a look? Ik denk dat dat het, uh, dat dat het uh, idee gaat zijn. Ik denk dat dat uh, bedoeling gaat worden. Nou, ah, trouwens. Als dat zijn wife is, dan zijn ze al getrouwd. Dus dan kan dat niet... Hetgene zijn waar ze naar zoeken. Misschien was mijn taat even verkeerd. What a stroke of luck! This little shop being open on Godwin's Day! <laughs> That must be uh, why it's called the Lucky Clover. That old lady we often bump uh, into said it had an unusual opening times, didn't she? Are you sure it's really open? The woman who runs it might just be stock taking or something. Well, it's certainly not uh, bustling with customers, it's true. Ah, look, there's Mr. Price, the owner. Uh, over there. Let's go and ask her. Hello, Mrs. Price. Ah, welcome. Feel free to... No, what am I thinking? What do you want? It's unusual to find a shop uh, open on Godwin's Day. It's actually very fortunate because... I'm not open. Oh, but we saw the doors was ajar, so we went through. And we went and thought, okay, not yet. I just came to pick up some things, that's all. I won't be here for long. The shop is closed today. So you won't sell us anything, you mean? 
I'm sorry, no. I'm on my way somewhere, actually. It's the bank holiday, after all. No one works on God Wednesday, do they? I'll have to ask you to come back another time. Oh, I see. What a pity. <coughs> Very sad indeed. Very sad. Ah, we've come away empty-handed. I really thought we'd struck gold when we found the lucky clover open. Does that mean clothes and accessories are off the list of possibilities then? Gosh, what a pickle! Well, uh, just uh, we'll just have to see if we can find another shop that's, shop that's open. Like where? Well, uh, there are a few uh, other shops around. Chancel Lane Corner, we could try, are there? <sighs> Sorry. Yes, it's worth a shot. Let's go and see what's what. So let's see, are there any of these shops open? The restaurant seems to be shut, miss. Mm, yes, everyone wants to take a holiday when they can, I suppose. Oh yes, perfect. Alex could sell us a birthday cake for Mr. H Mrs. Hastings. Do you think the patisserie is open? Let's go and ask. Thank me. Oh, and pizza. Bratski. Uh, that will not work. Uh, but you're way stupid way. Gosh, we seem to have caught them in the middle of an argument. Alex, Hans, what are you quarreling about? Oh, it's you. Uh, you come at the right time. We are trying to solve a difficult puzzle. Uh, maybe you can help us, Catriele. Yeah, that is the thing we got to know about. 111. Piece of cake. Wow, piece of cake. In the picture, you can see a cake in the shape of the number 6. You need to cut the cake in straight line to make two numbers. Uh, how could uh, how could you use the cake to make the largest pos possible total? Okay, if you add the two numbers together, okay. Kijk, je kan hem zo uh, doen, maar als het 1 en 0 blijft het 1, dus dat is... Uh, dat is niet handig. Hmm. Hmm, I see it not. The numbers will, t uh, will make by cutting the cake bo in both single digits. Yeah, da 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 Cut a straight uh, cut, cut it straight to make two numbers. Think about how to got cut so uh huh? Did you make a nine? Eh. 
Cakes are not flat. 9 en 9 is 18 dan, hè? A good puzzle is something you have to chew over. I ain't nothing but a hound dog. Goeie puzzel, goeie puzzel. Oh mijn god. Oh mijn god. Oh, now I'm seeing dancer. Uh, no, yes, it's very tricky. <laughs> uh, as a pâté is a way of cutting cakes is not good. Uh, it makes me uncomfortable. So, wh what are you do both doing here today? No, Bratsky and me, we are going out. Uh, so, no pâté. The so the pâté is not open today then. Try. And what about Elizabeth Tower? Is there ever, uh, never a maintenance work to carry out on the clocks at Big Bang on Cotton's Day? No, yes, sometimes, uh, but I adjust all the clocks carefully uh, yesterday. Uh, today is uh, no work day. Bratsky uh, and me uh, never uh, have a holiday at the same time, so we arranged from a long time ago to do something together. Uh, well, that sounds lovely. No, yes, I'm not sure. Uh, I'm thinking about staying home for relaxing instead, but the Bratsky wants to go out, uh, so Bratsky must go out. Uh, um, sometimes it's just nice to stay in, isn't it? What are you doing today, detective? Oh, what are you doing today, detective? <laughs> you want to see us uh, for something? <coughs> no, yes. Mm -hmm. uh, we're going, um, uh, we're doing a favor for Inspector Hastings. He's in a bit of a tough spot. No, yes? Careful, cat, it's catching. Uh, it's his wife's birthday today, you see? But he's being too busy solving crimes that he hasn't got her a present or cake or anything. No, yes, uh, the man is too busy. I was running uh, around to check in without that. Uh, we are a very great follow to Inspector. Uh, maybe there's something we can do at 12. Uh, Oh no, you wouldn't want to uh, inconvenience you. You're just your um, just on your way out. Where aren't you? I'm sure we'll manage something. Don't worry. Me good luck. Please buy an interesting and a funny gift for Inspector the wife. Thank you. We'll do our best. Uh, I hope um, the two uh, of you have a fun evening together. Well, looks like the cake isn't going to happen eaten either, so uh, we have to think of something else. I wonder how the inspector is getting along with uh, the case he was called to though. Even if we manage to find the person in time, uh, I, um, it won't do if Inspector Hastings, uh, Inspector himself isn't available. I'm gonna helemaal the part of you. No, that's true. Perhaps we should find him and let him know that we're getting on. Uh, who will find him? How will we find him though? Uh, do you know where he is? Let's go to Scotland Yard and if it's not there, uh, we can ask where to find him. En de rest doen we volgende aflevering. Bedankt voor het kijken van deze aflevering. Vond je het een leuke aflevering? Doe een duimpje omhoog. Zie je graag nog een keer weer. Adios, amigo.